Hi friends, in this session, I am going to discuss the most important question for the Thrasher for .NET developer. Differences between authentication and authorization. So, before going to discuss the differences between authentication and authorization, I strongly recommend you, if you till now did not subscribe my YouTube channel, then please, please subscribe my YouTube channel. In this channel, you will get all the .NET related interview questions and also logical and HR interview questions also. So let's start. So first we need to understand what is the authentication. So authentication is the process of verifying the identity of a user by obtaining some sort of, sort of credentials and using those credentials to verify the user's identity if the credentials are valid the authorization process starts so this is the authorization and now sorry sorry this is the authentication now i am going to discuss about the authorization what is the authorization so authorization is the process of allowing an authenticated users to access the resources by checking whether the user has access right to the system authorization helps you to control access rights by granting or denying specific permission to an authenticated user so authentication means <coughs> if you have the username or password then you can log in any social media and anything so that means it it is the verifying process that means it is the uh, authentication if you do if you are not uh, authenticated then if you are entering your username and password then you will get an error message that means uh, your username password is incorrect in authorization suppose if you already successfully log in then authorization means you have to access some pages um, means you access only those pages that are allowed by the uh, admin so without admin permission you cannot access all the through the website or through the pages so first difference is it is the process of verifying identity of a user in authorization it is the process of checking whether the user has the access right to the system and second difference is it always proceeds to authorization in authorization it is the process of allowing an authenticated user access to resources and third difference is in author authentication they have additional scheme like windows authentication forms authentication and passports authentication whereas in authorization the two ways are url authorization and file authorization and, and the fourth and last difference is it has two separate levels because all the requests coming through the ias before it 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 is handled and <coughs> it in authorization it allows two ways to authorize the access to a given resources so guys this is for two days and if you and thank you for watching friends like and share and subscribe my youtube channel and my uh, request is if you have any doubt suggestion for me please let me know through your comment and please like my video and subscribe my youtube channel thank you for watching thank you guys